Well, hello, glorious people of the interwebs, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Today, we're going to be getting one of the final rare yep. weapons you can get in this amazing game, and that is Otis Miller's Revolver. Those of you that have found one of the two torn treasure maps may be wondering what that is for, and once you reach Epilogue 1, you can actually get the second piece of the torn treasure map to acquire Otis Miller's Revolver. Now, as I mentioned, this does mean you need to be in Epilogue 1. And for those of you that don't know what happens at the end of Chapter 6 and don't want spoilers, you may not want to watch this episode. While I won't give any spoilers to the storyline, it may be a little obvious when we're in Epilogue 1. But regardless, you have had your spoiler warning, so let's go ahead and get into this. The first page of the Torn Treasure Map is going to be just north of Annisburg at the Hermit Shack at Manito Glade. Now, if you've been here before, you can still get the Torn Treasure Map Part 1, and this is also where you get the rare shotgun. So it's two for one special. Now, since we have just gotten into this part of the game, if he is here, which he is, I'm going to have to lasso his ass. Go, go, go! Got him. Woo! All right, I have no weapons, so just keep that in mind. I got to choke this guy out. It's a little aggressive. Go to sleep. Enter the sweet embrace of darkness. Oh, my God. Now that the hermit's dead, I can actually pick up my weapon. Maybe. Pick up. There we go. Hey, double-barreled shotgun. Now that would be the rare shotgun if... This was your first time doing it. And we got a new hat. So pretty cool. Now, if you've never been here before, there's going to be a couple things you can loot. And then one of these is going to be the torn treasure map. Now, I've gotten this before, but I believe I got it from this one right here. But just check all the spots in this particular cabin. Oh, wait. There was It was there. Torn treasure map one. And we've already gotten it, but it does actually respawn there, which is particularly interesting. Now to get the second piece of the torn treasure map, we're going to have to go to the female hermit's cabin, which is a little off the beaten path just northwest of Strawberry. And if you drop a point right up here, you'll actually see a little building. And that is the female hermit's little shack. And we're just going to pay her a visit. Now somehow this is actually my first time here. And I have no idea what to expect. I don't know if she's going to be... What is it, boy? Oh, no. Hey. Oh, the hell long oh she's got bork borks. Oh, three of them. Oh, shit. Ah! <laughs> oh, not the dogs. Oh, can I run them over? Run them over. There we go. I have no weapons right now, so... I, like, loaded the game and saved it. Or saved the game and then reloaded the save game. And the weapon I had stolen from the the other hermit disappeared. Ugh. I think those are blue ticks. <laughs> no. I feel really bad about this. I like dogs. Ugh. Oh, he's so lucky. Come here. Oh, I'm gonna get you, you stupid dog. Oh, I almost. Almost gotten gotten by a tree. Easy now. Get him. Oh, dog, you're so lucky. I wish I could lasso you, but I can't. There we go. Woo. All right, now that her dogs are take. Oh, Jesus, she's got a gun now, too? Damn it. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Why all these damn hermits got guns? Well, that's a stupid question. Man. That was ridiculous. She's got a nice a nice rifle there though. Anything you want me to hold on to? Actually, oh, a silver chain bracelet. Nice. There's something to inspect here. Why did my horse run away? Anyways, we got to go find this Beware of dogs. <laughs> Make sure to inspect the site. But she's got another torn treasure map. I'm guessing it's probably going to be in here. I guess we can let her live. 
I'd like to have a weapon for where we're going. And torn treasure map too. Stupid dogs. Oh my god. Alright, so. We can inspect the document. There we go. Now this location is in, uh, I believe it's just northwest of Armadillo. So we gotta head that way. Well, shit. I stopped in Armadillo. And for some reason, I don't have my weapons again. That shotgun that I got. And Armadillo is under attack. So I'm gonna try and... See if I can help out, see what's going on over here. We're here, Sheriff. And we got the money. You're gonna bring him out. Back off. Oh, it's Del Lobo's gang. Move in now. Oh god, this is not working out in my favor. Oh, get him, Sheriff! Let me trace you. You cheating sons of bitches! Oh, Pick up the gun. Pick it up! There's one left. Where are you at? Home skillet. I think that's in there. There we go. I didn't have a lot of bullets, so I had to make sure I did this right. Oh, that was close. What's going on, Sheriff? Oh my. Oh my. If it wasn't for you, sir. If it wasn't for you, whoo. How lucky we are. The hero we so require. Armadillo. Is indebted to you. Awesome. Oh, fear Jesus. Maybe beyond safe. Oh, oh! Jesus, he lost his hat. Pick up your hat, dude. Is this. Are we gonna get to talk now or what? Okay. <laughs> well, I'm gonna loot these guys, so. Thanks for the free weapons that I really desperately needed. Interesting, it's not letting me continue with this. I think I have to do more in Epilogue 1 before I can really have weapons or do anything, but I really wanted to show off the location for Otis Miller's revolver. So I guess, well, I don't know. It was fun assisting in that endeavor without actually having any weapons. And now for Otis Miller's treasure. I've been waiting for this for so long, and we finally found it. So, if you go open your map... All you need to do is go directly west from Twin Rocks. And just before you hit this little border, you'll be in Rattlesnake Hollow. And if you drop a pin pretty much right where I am here, you'll be able to find it. And it's going to be just north of the S in uh, Chala Springs. So just keep that in mind. It's directly north of that. And from this location, you can even see that little cabin that's down there. Now, just behind us is going to be this little formation here. There's going to be a small cave. Almost barely even noticeable. And we're going to go right up inside of here. And we're going to get a whole bunch of stuff. Well, let's see what we get inside. Oh boy, look at all that loot. Oh, an erotic photograph? Oh no. Oh, can we get a, a good look at what's inside of here? Oh no. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. All right, we're, we're going to have to take a look at this here. <laughs> we look at it. Oh, so we got Otis Miller's revolver there. There's a lot of those photographs in here. Can we go into our satchel and take a look at that thing? Let's see, around a, a photograph of a scantily clad woman. Oh, we can't, like, look at it, though. That's interesting. There's a bunch of them in there, though. So let's go ahead and pick up oh, the, 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 mil the revolver here. That's really what we came here for. Go ahead and take this photo. It's weird that we can't look at it. There's a whole bunch of them in here. What does R1 do? So it just switches in between things that are in here. <laughs> okay, interesting. So there's a, a cattleman's well that's the cattleman's revolver so that's that's all that's everything in here although it looks like there's pieces of some kind of rifle unfortunately that is all we can actually grab out of there but the real prize here is otis miller's revolver and i'm gonna see if we can actually look at everything else that's in there so the stats on this thing 
Not too shabby there. Damage is pretty high. Obviously, we don't have any other ammo types, so we can't check all that out. We can look at this beautiful weapon. There we go. Nice and gold. Look at that thing. We also got to read about it, too. Let's see your toggle view. Very nice. Probably one of the more pretty weapons in the game. It can only get it at the very, very end. I was going to be so mad if the game took my weapons. We can actually look at those photographs now, but I wanted to get a better look at that. Uh, but we'll check out the gun here in a second. We can look at all these photographs now that we're not crouching. Completely forgot we need to not be crouching. So, can we zoom in on that? No. <laughs> Is there no way to flip it or anything like that? Interesting. I figured there would be some sort of writing on them or something. Oh, we got some pasties there. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, let's see here. What else do we got? I'm gonna get demonetized. <laughs> All the apples. Oh, there is a... We, nope, there's nothing to read on this one. Interesting. Ah, well, we left our satchel accidentally. Just gonna make sure... Yep, nothing to read on this one. And we can't flip it or anything. I believe we have two more. Oh. Hello. Yep. So we just... We're just gonna care... What is... <laughs> we're gonna get in trouble. Jake's gonna find these. It's gonna be a big disaster. He's gonna be... I don't even want to think about that. Oh my goodness. Anyway, so those... <laughs> <laughs> the erotic photographs. Oh, no. But this weapon is... beautiful. Look at that thing. That's... that's the ticket right there. That's what I was looking for. Got a rabbit. Some kind of flap-flap thing. Obviously the M on it. And it's really not a bad weapon either. The Otis Miller Revolver is a rare skull field made of gold and ivory and adorned with custom engravings. Found inside a cave in Cola Springs, this weapon appears to have once been owned by the famed gunslinger Otis Miller. This gun has an ammo capacity of six rounds and can use regular high velocity split point express and explosive revolver ammo. Awesome. Now there is only one other weapon, or well, rare, revol well technically two. Uh, but we can also get, um, Douche Canoe's weapon. I can't remember Micah's weapon. Uh, but we can't get that until after Epilogue 2. So we're going to be working on that probably next. But hope you guys all enjoyed the episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new to the channel, you want to see more, feel free to subscribe because it's free. And I will see you all in the next one.